trying to hear with another video and um you know this this video i kind of like want to explain how i warm up and the fastest way i've learned to uh warm up as fast as you can so really what i do is i just run around i play one pub or you know half of a pub um in this sake i'm just gonna play half of a pub uh so i play half the pub with um just playing and my hands, me personally, I have very sweaty hands. So my hands start to get sweaty by halfway through the pub. And um, I just run around really, you know, trying to shoot as straight as I can. Trying to, you know, get as close to the person as I can when I'm shooting. You know, the whole pub just playing. And as you can see, I'm, I'm pretty accurate. Uh, I, could, I could be a little bit more accurate. I could be hitting a little bit more shots. Um, but for the most part, I'm getting the kills. I'm, you know, shooting straight enough to get the kills. As you can tell. Um, but it's not perfectly straight, if you know what I mean. Like, it's not a as good as I could be. It's not um, a as the maximum I could possibly shoot. It's not the straightest I could shoot. Uh, which, halfway through the pub, I will... Uh, kind of explain a way to fix that if you have uh sweaty hands or if you don't you know it, it works either way um me personally i have very very sweaty hands so after a pub half of a pub you know pub and a half something like that after a little bit you know a couple minutes of playing my hands start to seriously sweat where i lose control of my uh controller and my thumbstick or my thumb will actually switch switch off of my thumbstick and it will actually like miss and uh, make me miss bullets um which is very very unfortunate for me you know but there's a there's a quick easy fix um for that which is good so we're just gonna keep playing this pub and as you can tell you know those long range shots like that i was all over the place you know i i just didn't even hit a single bullet on that guy and that's uh something we're hoping to fix something we'll uh by the end of the pub we're hoping to get done so we're gonna we're gonna go till 35 kills um actually we'll go till 40 kills since it's 75 it's about we'll just go to 40 kills now nah, 35 sounds good um so yeah we'll we'll just keep playing we're almost there almost to uh not really the halfway point but it's almost half you know out of 75 kills you know Oh, so I just basically try to shoot uh, straight as, as, as straight as I can um, and just play the game really until I get to uh, it, it just keep playing and when I play competitive what I do is I just keep playing until the match like the pub before I start playing serious that's what I wait for since we're at uh, 35 right here what I do is I, I find a corner or something that I get into and then I grab my gamer grip. This thing is amazing. And no, I'm not sponsored by gamer grip. This is just me saying that gamer grip is key and it's amazing. And I just spread that on my uh, hands, mainly my thumbs. I don't really get it on the back side. Uh, I only do the thumb or the thumbs in the front side, the palms and everything. Things that are going to be touching my controller. And then I just uh, kind of like let that dry for a couple seconds. It's not dry enough. And this is what I do usually. I move my hands like that to uh, dry it. And then I pick up the controller again and die, obviously. <laughs> usually, I, I just pick up the controller and um, I finish out the pub. And usually, the gamer grip uh, helps a lot. You know, it it makes me shoot a lot straighter. It allows me to actually have control of uh, my controller. And my, like I said, my hands are very sweaty. So, I lose control of the controller very, very easily. So, the gamer grip is a quick, easy, and cheap... Uh, you know, away from, or, uh, what's the word I'm thinking of? Uh, holy crap, I can say, it's a way to not have, uh, sweaty hands and get over the fact that you're, uh, sweating and everything like that. It, it helps you grip, obviously, why it's called gamer grip. You know, it allows you to not slip from the controller. This is, it, it's really key for people that have sweaty hands, like me. If you're, if your hands sweat, the gamer grip's not completely dry at the moment. Usually I give it a, 
give it like 30 seconds or so but um but yeah basically what the gamer grip does is it allows you to uh completely like lose the sweat and it clogs up your um pores i guess and basically gives you grip to uh hold your controller and when i wear a gamer grip um i feel like my reaction time my aim like that right there my my reaction time my aim my far distance aim everything is just so much faster so much smoother and i can do so much more um like i said no gamer grip is not sponsoring me for this video this is my own opinion my beliefs when uh when I find a product that works and and it truly works for me and you know I've, I've heard only good things about it and I've seen the results because it happens to me and it helps me I, I give praise to that a lot because if you can show to me that you the products works I will I, I will continue to buy it and continue to use it and um, even at that if, if I know it works I'll even have um, kind of be a spokesperson and tell other people that it definitely works you know like it, it helps when it's shaky like that it doesn't really help but um gamer grip i i always if you ever watch my streams um when i play competitive i always say gamer grip is key it helps my aim helps my reaction time helps a lot it didn't fully dry but that's usually what i do i for the sake of a video i only did half of a pub and half of a pub usually what i do is i practice with no gamer grip um, on all the pods until the match before or the pub before I start playing competitive and then for that pub I put it on and then I play that whole pub with it and then it by the end of the pub I'm not missing bullets. Maybe I'll miss one bullet, but I'm barely missing any bullets. So uh, Gamer grip is key in my opinion. It helps a lot like comment, subscribe all that good stuff Follow me on Twitter and Twitch link in the description and as always guys have a nice day evening or night wherever you guys live in the world Meanwhile. Yeah. Yeah.